We were Jay Leno's publicists. I'm sure the fans want to know. Do you have any stories about Jay Leno you could share with us? Overall, he is as nice a person in real life as he appears to be. I hung out with him a number of times backstage at The Tonight Show. The funny story, Devin, is once I was back there, it was me and my boss and him and his manager in his dressing room. And Jay, is literally, <laughs> Jay is literally in his underwear. Okay, He's wearing his boxer shorts and nothing else. And I knock on his dressing room door and he goes, hey, Dan, yeah, come on in, come on in. Yeah, everything's fine. I go, really? Jay, you're, you know, you're in your underwear. No, no, it's fine. Yeah, come on in. Yeah, it's, it's, it's fine. Everything's cool. Yeah. You know. And we came in. We had a nice talk. Couldn't be nicer. So I, I guess my funniest story, really, <laughs> really, that only happened once. But, I'm, you know, I'm with Jay Leno and he's in his underwear at the Tonight Show. And it just shows what a authentic, you know, normal regular guy he was and i saw him again last year at vons and just just as nice to me couldn't have been nicer he seemed now now he of course he's got to be worth hundreds of millions of dollars when i represented him he had just gotten the tonight show so now he's a legend he's got to be unbelievably wealthy same same guy same night hey dan how you doing nice to see you yeah is that your daughter yeah okay yeah let me see you nice guy so Big picture of Jay Leno, nice guy, just like he appears to be. No errors about him. I knew Jerry Seinfeld before he was famous. And I met Jerry Seinfeld again after he was famous. Jerry changed a lot. Jerry became very jaded. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I remember you. Like, like you pee on, you know. So, and they're, and they're best friends. So, Jay stayed exactly the same. Jerry really got affected big time. Jay Leno, very nice guy. Jerry, I can't say very nice things about, you know. Well, he did stick up for Kramer after Kramer's rant for whatever that says about him. But yeah, he did. It does yeah. say something about the friendship, but uh, that was pretty bad. That happened in your neck of the woods, too. It did. I remember that very well. Yeah. This, and I don't even think he was drunk or anything when he did that. No, he was being, he was bombing. He was having, I, there was a big article in the LA Times about this very recently. He was not doing well. He was not doing well that night as a stand-up comic. It was at the Laugh Factory on Sunset Boulevard. And some people in the audience were saying, you know, it's Kramer, you suck. Get off the stage, Kramer. You're not funny. You suck. And and they happened to be African-American. And boy, did he turn. Did he turn. And boy, he he still, he, he'll regret that forever. That's a hard thing to come back from. That was a huge mistake. Luckily, he's got enough residuals. That show is still airing. He never has to work again. Yeah, but he, he didn't never get, will work again. Yeah, he never he didn't get Jerry money or Larry David money. You know, those guys got built. Yeah. They got built the billions. The other ones got tens of millions. Jerry and Larry, Jerry got a billion. Larry got half a billion. The others probably each got tens of millions. That's not bad. Not bad. But yeah, he never. Remember Pee Wee Herman? What he did, right? Pee Wee Herman. Yeah, thank back. God he came back. Yeah, thank what? God. That what? wouldn't even be a thing today. Yeah, I, mean, I think people would laugh. 